Hey YouTubers, this is Mr. Slinky, and I'm here to teach you how to fight barbarians. Um, this has been a major problem with a lot of people. A uh, very big problem, because barbarians have a perk where um, they uh, have a perk called Last Stand. Where when they when one of them dies, all the rest of them gain plus three to their attack and their defense. Uh, that doesn't seem like a very big bonus, but when you get down to like the last two guys and they have like twenty plus attack and defense, it can be quite a problem for you. Um, you can do this with Iron Age archers, but I would not suggest doing it until you have at least crossbowmen. It becomes a lot easier when you have crossbowmen. Um, I've also been able to do this with Berserks, but I had a lot higher death toll with Berserks than I did with uh, Crossbowmen. Uh, on my Corch world, I actually did this with Longbowmen, and that extra range really helped. Of course, everyone has a different compilation every one of these. Uh, some of them have uh, what look like slingers, but they're pretty much like the ranged version of the barbarian. Um, but you're gonna have this, pretty much the same strategy for all of these. Uh, what, you're gonna, what you're gonna wanna do is bring your guys within range of theirs first, and then hit every one of them. Do not kill any of them yet. You're going to wound them to where there are about two health left. Even if you can, if you, uh, you're in range to kill them, don't. Just wait. Wait around. Also, if you can, try to avoid um, using the sabotage button on these. It'll make your life a lot easier because if you accidentally kill them, because my crossbowmen do nine, can uh, have a possibility of doing nine damage. If they're sabotaged, that could kill them, and then the rest of them would gain the bonus. So try not to. Alright, now this is the round that you're going to kill them all. Well, most of them. And that guy's going to do some major damage. Yeah, see, now if you can see, um, defense bonus of 24 and attack bonus of plus 9. Uh... He's got 31 attack and 27 defense. That is because all seven of the other guys died. That gives him a 21 attack and defense bonus. Luckily though, he's got one health. So, that is why you do that. Uh, you have to use that strategy of hurting them all first and then killing them. Again, as I said before, you can do it with archers. Regular archers, I've done it before. Uh, but it is way easier if you wait, just wait an age or two until you get at least crossbowmen. Uh, you can also do it with mounted archers, but mounted archers actually have low attack, um, and, uh, they're just pretty much useless to me. I hate all early middle age troops. Um, but yeah, uh, crossbowmen is the way to go. It's the way to go. Uh, yeah, I just beat the province, so I got the little award thing there.
some gold and supplies and some metals. Now I'm gonna scout that. By the way, the reason I have not done all these yet is because I was waiting to get my bandy cam fixed. For whatever reason, it stopped working. But it's fixed now, and now I can make videos for my YouTube fans again. Yay! Um, if you want to uh, see me on Forge of Empires, I'm on pretty much every world. There's only a few that I'm not on. Uh, it, whatever world you're on, shoot me a message in the comments. Uh, tell me your username, I'll look you up, add you as a friend, or invite you to my guild. Um, when you uh, beat all of these, you'll get something called a monastery, which gives your city a plus 20% defense. Uh, gives your troops plus 20% defense when defending. Uh, and yeah, that is how you beat the barbarians. Um, if you get to the very last province, the barbarians are actually not barbarians. They're uh, Iron Age troops with a plus 75% attack and defense. However, crossbowmen still completely rule over them. Uh, and you can pretty much fight them however you want because they don't have the uh, last stand bonus. Um, but yeah, uh, hit a like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.